What's up everybody? Keith on your screen. It is day 21, aka the last day of week 3. These 21 days have flew by and, I don't know, it became a habit of doing this daily up until yesterday. And I like making the videos. It's been really helping me out. People who have reached out to me that don't really talk to me, honestly, it's really cool of you. Even though we don't talk and never like, really spoke outside of uh, little events, it's really cool of you to reach out and give off your positive vibrations you know so thank you i have no valid excuse for not doing a video yesterday i just simply didn't do it, it happens but today i have really good information for you and it involves my stretch marks they're everywhere they're literally here there's some stretch marks here there's even some between the stretch marks here and there like i don't know if you could see it but they're everywhere and the first time I heard stretch marks, it's very crazy. I was a kid. I was, I don't know, 12. Just to remind you, I was a very big boy. In fifth grade, I weighed 190 pounds. And about five years ago, I was over 300 pounds at 5 foot 10. No bueno! I haven't weighed myself in a while, but I know I'm around 250, 2 something. Back to the stretch mark talk. But yeah, the first person to tell me about stretch marks, it was a tita. By the way, tita means aunt in Tagalog, which is a Filipino language. It could also just mean a family friend who is like an aunt to you or maybe someone you just met two minutes ago at the grocery store, she's your tita now. But pretty much that's a tita. A tita at a pool party once said, Kid, you have stretch marks already? Well, yeah, they're, they're right there. She goes and tells me, Kid, you know who has stretch marks? Pregnant people. Not even a teenager yet? Like, how do you think I digested that? It made me think that I'm terrible, I'm huge, I'm way bigger than I should be. I got stretch marks at age like 11, 12 or something like that and I'm like wow, these pregnant people, they're stretching and I'm guessing that I'm getting as big as pregnant people. It made me feel like a planet. Obviously, I don't care about them now, but I could see why people get really discouraged by seeing stretch marks. They just think of, damn, I'm getting really, really fat. But just last night I googled how we get stretch marks and the first thing on Google, if you look up how we get stretch marks, it says it's normal. People get stretch marks through puberty. If I was 12 and I read that sentence saying that it was normal, I wouldn't feel as bad as I felt. Also, I do know it's not normal for me to have it all over my body. I do have a problem with my weight and I'm working on it. And I'm not saying my stretch marks are just normal. These are not normal. Like 300 pounds is not normal at 5 foot 10. It is bad. But I just want to remind everyone that stretch marks, it literally is, it's an appearance thing. Guess what? They're there. I view these stretch marks as the past plus the present. The past because, well, you're growing, your skin is growing and it's making a mark because it's stretched. And the present because, well, it's there. I'm looking and it's there. But I've learned that if you let your past divine your future, it's never going to really help out. Like, you can't live in your past. You can't live by just being sad you have stretch marks. You could get some cream to eventually make them go away. You could not really care about them, like, like what I do. They're there, and it's gonna come, it, it could go away later if they never come off. Like, am I healthy? Is my heart pumping? Is my brain still functioning? Am I mobile? That's what I care about. I don't care if I have stretch marks. I don't care if I have six pack abs. It'd be cool one day though. I, don't really, I really don't mind what's going on here versus what I'm making go on, you know? So all I'm saying is, the stretch marks, they kind of suck. I got empathy for people that really dislike stretch marks because there's a super bad stigma to them from the get-go when I heard about them. Pregnant people. Don't let stretch marks discourage you. And my friend, he didn't even call them stretch marks. Last time he was like, oh yeah, it was weird. I got these lightning bolts all of a sudden. I guess got struck by lightning. I thought that was the funniest thing. Of course he's not being serious. He's 25 years old and the first time he's ever got stretch marks, but it's like, stretch marks. So I hope you use this to your advantage. I hope you remember stretch marks don't mean anything in reality. And I hope you get some good stuff done today. I will see you next time. Don't stop moving. Bye. 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 Bye.